about the games that you play. Six. One, How many of those games involve counting? programme, this sign will appear now and again. Keep a count of how many times. This is number one. These children are using a computer to keep a counting record of the other children going to lunch. If they keep going at the same rate, the computer calculates that around 600,000 children could be going for lunch in just a week. Hi, I'm High Tech. My friends call me HT. The other day, I was doing some pond watching. HT peered down through the surface of the water. It could see things moving. Black, wriggling, darting backwards and forwards. Tadpoles! shouted HT. Tadpoles! Wow! Lots of tadpoles! One, two, three, four, five, and that one, six. Keep still a moment. Seven, eight, no! I've counted that one already. Eight. Oh, this is hopeless. Nine. Oh! H.T. groaned. Why was it that even the simplest tasks, like counting a few tadpoles, turns out to be so difficult? If only they'd stay still for a bit. H.T. closed its eyes and tried to imagine what would happen if all the tadpoles would, well, just sort themselves out. There's three lots of six, 18, one of five, um, 23, one of four. Ow! If only they keep still. Now, five, 10, 15, 20, 25. With four more, twenty-nine. Twenty-nine tadpoles. It's easy, this counting, said H.T. Well, if you organise things just a bit. One, two, three, four.
everybody gets involved in counting. Engineers count cars. Planners count people. Cashiers count money. Chemists have their pills counted for them. Think about buying goods at the supermarket. Do you always buy things one at a time? Do you always count in ones? Does the supermarket always sell things one at a time? Do they always count in ones? These girls are counting in jumps of seven. Thirty-five. Forty-two. Forty-one. Forty-three. Fifty-six. How high can you get counting in jumps of seven? Sixty-three. All over the world, people count. Many of us use the same signs for our numbers. It's only when we speak our numbers that we find it difficult to understand one another. 